been here since about 7, 7.30 at Primal just to get in and I'm almost at the door so let's do some damage to my account, right? Oh, oh. content creator here on YouTube and if this is your first time watching or coming across my channel welcome join the family by subscribing turning on the notification button so that when I upload a video you guys will be able to be the first person to check out that you know I've uploaded a video thank you so much for clicking onto my channel so guys today today today, today, today I'm so excited I've got a Primark haul a Primani haul Primark is back ladies and gentlemen they are back in business ever since lockdown they've been shut for like three months and today in the uk they said um all non-essential stores and shops can you know open up i got to primer very early the queue was mad i was able to get in they are definitely following the government procedures they've got you know queues waiting outside social distancing measures at the till checkout they've got hand sanitizer before you you know proceed into the stores um there isn't part like a social distancing on the floor when you're shopping per se but people are using their common sense to basically give each other like spaces and you know not like clustering the whole you know clustering the whole place so it was actually all right when i went to the shop but the only thing is that the queues were long but it was efficient so it wasn't like you had to be in the queues for so long but the thing is that there was a lot of people controlling the crowd so it was really really like actually all right to shop in primark you know apart from like the queues that we're not normally used to queuing outside before we go into primark and then when you're inside there's a way you have to queue and you have to make you have to actually stand in that box that says two meter like if you don't stand there, someone will actually come and give you a telling off so like it was actually like i found it to be really really easy so primark has some really really nice pieces and some really lovely home decor guys if you're looking for any home decor please go to primark primark is the one so I'm going to show you guys, start off with accessories, what I bought, and then I'm going to show you guys the outfit that I bought, because this outfit as well is from Primark, hence the logo on it, so yes, we're just going to do this video like that, okay? So, first thing I is, I got like, obviously you guys know how the bag looks like and all of that, so I got, let me just start with some shades, <laughs> I got some nice pairs of shades, like white shades, like, oh, wait, 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 let me, can I take off the tag? Okay, like, it's so chic. Like, I'm going to put this outfit together and I'm actually going to take a picture for the gram. This is so chic. And I bought it in a black as well. So I've got in a white and I've got in a black. But the black version is more like a, you know, the the ribbons kind of um, wafer. Is it wafer? I can't remember how to say it. But anyways, it's like those ribbons sort of ones, but it's a bit elongated at the um, edges here. This is how it looks like. Oh, like, come on darlings um, I got some LED lights for like I'm trying to like get my room done like in a nice you know just make my look, look, room look pretty so this is like the fairy light but this is one is more less fairy but it still gives you the light but anyways actually it's called firefly light sorry firefly light that's that one then if you've also obviously watched my skincare routine you know that these are the kind of cutting cutting uh, wool or cosmetic pads. I don't know how I call it cotton wool. It's the Nigerian in me. <laughs> but anyway, this is the cutting pads. Um, the cutting pads. The cosmetic pads that I normally use to take off my makeup, to tone my face, my skincare routine. I don't. My skincare routine is incomplete without using this. So I bought three of this. I stocked up on this because I actually just stocked up before quarantine started. I mean, before lockdown started. 
lockdown started and they didn't even have this particular one they had the other one that was like half of this for like 90 people anyway i stocked up on the big ones as usual then i got like some i got a sandal or what's it not some sandals it's like a dupe for is it the birkenstock Ber birkenstock sandals but i got this one um, it's white. I just realized that because I didn't want to buy anything sandals or shoes or anything because I've got quite a lot of shoes at home But I decided that you know what the white sandals I got that I took to Nigeria did not make it back with me to the UK So I was like, you know what? Let me buy another pair of like white cute summer sandals because when the beauty shop opens I want to get my nails and my toenails done. So I want to get like you know that matchy matchy white sandals white nails Yes, that's what I want to do. So <laughs> yeah, that's why I got this one and this is kind of like I could feel it It's low quality, but hey, we only have summer for like two months in this UK So trust me in two months it will still look pretty decent and it will serve its purpose and it was five pounds Which is not bad at all So those were like literally pretty much the accessories I got then moving on to home decor, I wanted to get so many things, but in my head I'm like, you know what, calm down, girl. Because I know by the time I go back, I probably won't find it because some people would have, you know, hoarded it. But anyway, I was able to purchase this. I've been looking to get this kind of plant um, from for the longest. And I was actually looking for it um, during lockdown. I was like, I'm going to go to a garden centre once the garden centre is open again. But I was able to get this from Primark for, I think, 18 or £20. Pounds. Yeah, and it's so lovely. It's so lush. Look at the way it just fits in. It fits in there with my little cute bag here. But obviously, you've got to open it up for it to have that, like, full effect. Um, there was a couple, if you were on my Instagram, I posted it. Like, if anybody wanted to purchase. They had the palm trees ones as well. They had quite, quite a lot in Primark. So, yeah, you just have to open it up and make sure that it looks really, like, full. It's lightweight, you can move it anywhere, and I love the um, the the vase detailing. It's so so cute. Like I just feel like this detailing here is so nice. Like it's so lush. So moving on to outfit because I really went there to look for clothes because Primark is like big. I'm gonna put this in for a minute. So Primark is big when it comes to clothes. And um, for reference, guys, I am. Um, I, I, I consider myself to be a plus, plus size anyway. So I wear 16 um, on the bottom, 18 on the top because I'm top heavy. But ever since then, um, lockdown, your girl has, um, you know, gotten a little more rounder. So I'm actually an 18 up and down at the moment. But only what is involved. God is in control. We're gonna, you know, shed this weight and work it out, work it out. So this top I'm wearing is from Primark. I got all my tops, and obviously I'm gonna be showing you guys all from Primark except this head hat because I just thought it looked cute with this outfit. This was from Pretty Little Things, anyways, and it has this like gold detailing at the side here. It's super cute. But anyways, um, this top was from Primark. I think it was about five six pounds. It's just a basic shirt and um, it's like an oversized shirt so i went like a really really like big big size up so i think this is a size 20 this is how it looks like i obviously tucked it in without it being tucked in it's literally around like just right here on my thigh so it's quite big but i love the like it's so comfortable and i love the fact that it has this nice print in front these shorts as well from primark they were i think 12 pounds yes 12 pounds and it's called the grey high-waisted um, short. It's so nice. It's so comfortable. This is a size 18 and this is how it looks like. I feel like this is so nice. Like you rock it to the beach, you can rock it on a normal day. I love the, um, what's it called? I love the um, little tassel things on here. It's so nice. And I paired it obviously with a Converse, <laughs> the white Converse. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but yes, that's what I paired it with a white Converse, and it's so so nice and it's comfortable. I like it. I really love it a lot. It's quite chic. It's just very summer, like hot girl summer. Hey, hot summer 2020 is not cancelled yet because we're still gonna move, right? But anyways, moving on. Another thing where I paired this when I was purchasing it was I'm gonna get like him summer jacket i don't really have a summer jacket the summer jacket i normally rock a like jeans jacket but it doesn't really go with everything you want to wear during the summer so i said you know what let me purchase a leather jacket and this leather jacket was is in a size 20 and it is 14 pounds or it was 14 pounds and it's in a size 20. i like my jackets to be very big on me like i remember i do have one jacket that is a size 22 and guys it's like they put, threw me into that jacket but i just love my jackets being big 
and this is it a size 22 I could have gotten away with it in a size 18 but I just wanted it to have to just be a little bit free and this is how it looks like guys look at this outfit what what like look at this I feel like a biker's girlfriend or something but anyways yes you can definitely zip it so if you zip it if it gets a bit cold at night or something, you can zip it up like that. Has it got a pocket or is it just design? Oh, it's actually got pocket. It's got pocket as well. So yeah, this one's got pocket and this is how it looks like all the way to the back. Normally, things like jacket like this, leather jacket, I just like to rock it like this. If you want, you can go ahead and put a belt in this loop just to give this look a little bit more sweet, spicy touch. But yes, I really love this. This is super, super cute, super amazing and yeah i'm gonna take you guys to the next outfit the next thing i got in primark was this top and this mom jeans this mom jeans is actually very very snug on me and this is a size 18. don't know if i should go up to a size 20 but i feel like 20 would be too big because i do pretend or i do plan on losing weight so i don't want to buy things that is gonna like be a waste so this is a mom jeans it's quite tight it's quite snug it's comf comfy snug but i just feel like mom jeans i feel like they're meant to be a bit baggy on you right but anyways this one was um 15 pounds it's a vintage mom jeans and this racer top was i can't remember how much i really like the color of it it looked really really nice i don't like when tops when i wear like tops and trousers that expose the fact that i have a fupa like to the glory of jesus christ so what i'll do is this is how this one looks like on me anyway so i'm going to find um, a pair of um probably trousers or something that I could wear it with and if I don't find it then I'll just probably take it back obviously with this kind of tops you want to wear like a half bra because um, it's a racer top and your bra lines will show so you have to wear like a half bra for it I like the color and everything but we're putting it on now I don't know if it's just because of the trousers I'm wearing or whatnot I'm not really feeling it yet so I'll try another outfit in a minute but I'm just gonna try a couple of tops so that you guys will be able to see how it looks like so the next tops I'm going to try actually let me try with let me try with this top actually this is like a pink top so let me try it on and see how it looks like this is another one that I've got from um, Primark this is a pink top it's super cute I actually don't have anything of this color in my um, wardrobe so it's really nice very summery like I said again this jeans is really like squeezing my fat here and I don't like it when I put on outfit so obviously I would probably have to look for another trousers or another um, outfit that would suit this and this top is actually a bodysuit a top top it's actually a bodysuit but it's really really nice if I suck in my tummy you know it gives me that yes baby girl the back is quite low so this is how the back looks like so you have to wear a half bra technically I get my bras for top heavy girls on brastock.com if you follow me on my Instagram you see the kind of bras that I buy from them it's so it's really really nice it's very supportive like I literally don't have a strap on and this is how this is just me so it's very very supportive i love your brows on that side and this is how this top looks like on me it's super cute um but yeah i think this one was probably like about let me see how much it is and this is a size 14 16 actually uh the price is eight pounds eight pounds for this eight pounds though rah i just think it's so expensive for eight pounds should be about like six pounds or five pounds but why eight pounds? What's so special about it? The sleeves, like, nah, this is expensive. What the heck? But I actually like this. This is really cute. And I love this outfit as well. I could actually rock it, you know. Probably wear a waist strainer, cinch my waist in a little bit, and yeah, it's so cute. Let me know what you guys think of this one. Like, so cute. Like, hey darlings, hey baby, hey honey. Yeah. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm actually gonna show you this top with another pair of jeans, just to make sure that you know this jeans is the one that is deceiving me and not the tops that are actually cute. Because next is this denim short. It's a paper bag short, and this is in a size 18. And how much was this? 13 pounds. And yet again, it is exposing my foot part, but it's not too bad. Uh, okay, let me try it in a very decent way. <laughs> but yes. Um, this one is, how much is this again? 13 pounds. Jeez, why at uh, this price is shocking me. I see if I wasn't the one that spent the money for it on it. But anyways, this is so nice. This is super cute. I love the contrast with the pink and the blue and the back. Oh, it's just giving me booty. Booty, 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 booty. <laughs> 
Like, this is actually giving me ass. Like, I don't have ass, but this is, it, it, it firms. It's giving me that, can you guys see? Oh no, you guys can't see. Like, it's giving me that apple bottom, bum bum. But anyways, um, yeah, I really like this one. This outfit is mad. It's actually mad. I'm actually gonna, wow, wow, wow. Nah, I like it, I like it, I like it. That mom jeans, this mom jeans, I'm actually gonna take it back. Fingers crossed, I'll find a size 20. If I find a size 20, then I'll take it because I feel like mom jeans are meant to be baggy, but this is super tight. But guys, look at this though. Look at this outfit. Oh, come on. I am not your mate. Like, you just wanna do, hey, Zaddy. Zaddy. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not serious, but oh my god, this is so cute. Like, it's so, so cute. I love this paperback short. It's so nice. It's super, super nice. So, I'm actually going to try either the blue or the red, or coral red, on with these jeans. Hmm. Which one should we try? Which one should we try? Let's try the red one, actually. So, it's a, a pop of color. You know, just a pop of color, color. So, I've worn this other tops that I got in different colors. And this is like a coral red. And it's... um sort of like a racer back but it's got really really tiny strings or tiny straps and this is how the back looks it's quite low but perfect for summer and it's perfect for like you know if you're going to work and you can put a blazer on or something it's really nice very comfortable this is also a bodysuit as well the only thing i don't understand is my boobs are moving mad right now this part is perfectly fine but this part feels like it's spilling out so I'm not understanding what's going on. Like I'm really not understanding what's going on. But it's super cute. I got them in um white, I mean black and blue. So I bought black because of probably work. I could wear it under like blazers and stuff. And I bought blue because it's hot girl summer. So yeah, this is how this two will probably look like on me when I put them on. I'm not gonna try them on because it's just to see the fit and how they look like, right? So yeah. So I'm trying on this top again just to give it another chance to see if it would come through and I'm wearing it now with a strapless bra and I don't have a dungarees in my wardrobe at all. I've always wanted one but I just could never find my size. Is this the right side? Yeah, it is the right side. Could never find my size. This is a size 18 um, but when I was wearing it I had to take off one of the buttons at the side. Let me see if I can put that back. Okay. And then this one gonna be here and put this here as well uh, okay uh, let me put this, pop this back on okay ah come on okay is it in it's not in is it in yes it's in okay so this is how the dungarees looks with this top now the issue here is this part obviously i think you can let me see if i can fasten it okay yes i can okay okay i can fasten it oh god i'm so hot wait let's do this right i've sort of fastened it dungarees is pretty cool pretty nice pretty trendy i feel like dungarees is always in trend anyway so those are one of the pieces that i'll definitely be keeping I really really like it. This orange top, I'm not feeling it at all. It looks super cute on the color on the hangers and stuff in the store, but on me it's just not working out. And I really like the color because I was like orange-ish is always my color, it always pops on my skin, but I don't know what's going on with this one. It's just not hitting it like that. So I'm definitely gonna take this back uh, because it's just not banging like that. But this dungarees I really like. I really love this dungarees, it's so so cute. When it comes to dresses, me and Primark, we don't mix with dresses because I feel like they just don't get, I don't find a dress that suits my body shape for Primark. Summer dresses, normal dresses, I just don't. But when I see it on other people, it looks so nice. But when I wear it, it's, ah, uh, so that's why I was really skeptical. I just bought this like, okay, let me just give it a chance and see if it would actually work. So I'm just going to try this one now. This is the last thing that I bought and I'll let you guys know how it fits. How it looks like on me. Now, <laughs> there is a button problem. I feel like this happens with pretty much some of my clothes so I'm not really mad at that and um, I really like this it's very 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 comfortable very comfortable to wear on days that is super super hot here in the UK just something that you could just wear and throw on and um, I'm wearing a strapless bra as well so probably that's what is probably that's why it has this holes 
this little hole peeking through to my boob area so what I can do is I probably wear like my full bra and tuck it in um, on my strap here or I pin it so I'm just going to look for a safety pin and just pin it together and make it look cute but yes this is how it looks like you know it complements my skin color as well it's really really nice I don't have booty so it's not giving me anything for booty no booty support whatsoever it has like an elastic band here just before the booby area so I think you know it will support and control the movement but I don't know why it does has why it has a like I don't know what the point is for this but anyways yeah, this is cute. So if I pop the jeans jacket on, this is how it's going to look like. So if I was just going on like maybe a cute date night during this summer, if we have time to go on dates because 2020 has just, you know, shown us all sorts. But I just if I was going on a date and a cute guy, you know, wants to take me out and stuff and I just don't want to do the most, but I want to do the most, I'll just actually wear this kind of thing, you know, like this kind of hair color, like bob, nice bob, just nice cute outfit like you know you could probably wear a pair of heels or probably that like it was a casual date then i could wear those, that white birkenstock from earlier then um, birkenstock dupe that i showed you guys from earlier i could just wear that and just rock it like something casual you're not doing the most but it looks super cute yeah that's like that's that's it's it's fab it's that brings me to the end of my Primark haul. I hope you guys have enjoyed the few little cute pieces that I got and I'm going to be probably wearing this summer. That's if we have summer because if we don't have summer then it just goes into my summer collection for clothes. It goes into my summer collection for clothes for next year or probably if there's a dirty December we can use it at that motive as well. If anybody doesn't know what dirty December is, that's when everybody goes back to Nigeria for Christmas and it's always it's always a vibe it's literally a vibe so yes i would definitely recommend you guys to go check out primark and pick up some pieces they did have some nice lovely jeans dresses and stuff but like i said with dresses as well with primark i'm a bit skeptical because i'm tall and obviously booby as well so thank you guys so much for watching if you really did enjoy this and you want more primark haul comment down below like you want more primark hauls let me know so that i'll be able to go out and fish and dish out for more pieces for you guys let me know if you want a primer call for like work as well because i know a lot of people are going back next to work next month so that's all i wanted to share thank you so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe please please subscribe like let's grow this channel i have a goal of 10k i really want to hit 10k guys please make sure to share this video and thank you so much for watching and i will talk to you guys in my next video bye for me and my whole hair yeah we're saying bye to you guys yeah because we love you like that you love it like that. Oh, look, look how it looks like. Oh, come on. This dress is nice. What? Anyway, bye guys. <laughs>